The Philippines has again received an increase in its defense strength with the arrival of German-made Tiger attack helicopters. The arrival of these helicopters will take the Philippines to a higher level in terms of weapons and national security. Recently AN-124 rustling cargo plane landed at Clark Air Base Philippines delivering two Manila Tiger attack helicopters May 30, 2024. A big surprise occurred in the Philippines with the landing of Anna and four rustling cargo planes at Clark Air Base. How many days ago the giant plane was carrying two German-made Tiger attack helicopter ordered by our Philippine Army AN-124 rustling aircraft arrived at Clark Air Base with a special load of two Tiger attack helicopters belonging to the German Army. The helicopter was handed over as part of a military cooperation agreement between Germany and the Philippines. This cooperation aims to strengthen the Philippines' defense capabilities and face various security challenges in the Southeast Asia region. The presence of AN-124 aircraft arriving at Clark Air Base attracted the attention of many people considering the ongoing political tensions between Russia and the West. The aircraft also sparked speculation and questions about the true purpose of sending the Tiger helicopters. The Tiger attack helicopter is known as one of the best combat helicopters in the world, equipped with various advanced weapons such as automatic cannons, anti-tank missiles and rockets. It is also very maneuverable and can operate in various terrains including urban areas carried by two types of helicopters, namely modern attack helicopter models. Equipped with a variety of advanced technology they are capable of carrying out various missions including ground attack reconnaissance and air protection. This helicopter was developed by the giant German aeronautics company, Airbus Helicopters. The Tiger helicopter is equipped with advanced technology and deadly weapons. With powerful attack capabilities and high speed, Tiger helicopters will provide significant additional strength to Philippine troops in facing various security challenges at home and in the surrounding region. The Eurocopter Tiger is a four-blade, twin-engine attack helicopter that first entered service in 2003. It is manufactured by Airbus Helicopters, formerly Eurocopter, which emerged from the merger of the respective helicopter divisions of Aerospatial and DASA. Airbus Helicopters renamed it the EC-665. In France and Spain, the Tiger is known as Tigre, French and Spanish for Tiger, while in Germany it is called Tiger. The Tiger has the distinction of being the first composite helicopter developed in Europe. The earliest models also included other advanced features such as glass cockpits, stealth technology, and high agility to increase their survivability. The improved variant is equipped with a more powerful engine and is compatible with a wider range of weapons. Since entering service, the Tiger has been used in combat in Afghanistan, Libya, and Mali. Apart from that, the arrival of the Tiger attack helicopter is also expected to strengthen relations between the Philippines and Germany in the fields of defense and security. This collaboration is expected to pave the way for the exchange of information, technology and training between the two countries in an effort to strengthen their defense. With the arrival of German-made Tiger attack helicopters, the Philippines is increasingly prepared and resilient in facing security threats that may come. Hopefully this collaboration can provide great benefits for both countries and bring security and tranquility to the Filipino people. The Tiger is capable of carrying out a variety of combat missions including reconnaissance, anti-tank and close air support missions, escort and protection of friendly assets, and can operate day or night in all weather conditions. The Tiger is also designed to operate after nuclear, biological or chemical war. Tiger can also be used in maritime areas. It is capable of operating from the deck of a ship like a frigate in extreme weather conditions. The Tiger has a very high level of agility thanks to its 13-meter long hingeless four-blade main rotor design. The Tiger can perform full turns and G-force maneuvers. The Tiger is powered by a pair of MTU Turbomecha Rolls-Royce MTR390 turboshaft engines controlled by FADIC. The Tiger has a tandem seat glass cockpit and is operated by a two-person crew. The pilot is in the front position and the gunner is in the back seat. One crew member can control weapons or flight systems, they can switch roles if necessary. In addition to flying the helicopter, Tiger pilots will typically control self-defense and communication systems, as well as some secondary weapons functions. While some weapons use special interface control systems, such as the TriGat anti-tank missile, air-to-air -air weapons can be controlled with both collective and cyclic control lever sets. 
This delivery is expected to increase the Philippine Army's combat capabilities in dealing with various incoming security threats. The N-124 Rusland aircraft also carried an important message about the importance of modernizing defense equipment for the Philippines, which the country has long been pursuing. To increase its military capabilities and the arrival of Tiger helicopters is a concrete step in this modernization effort, it is hoped that it can increase the operational effectiveness of the Philippine military in various situations.